was at dinner with some friends, which was odd for me. I usually hit the gym on that particular night, but I chose to go eat with my friends. So the irony of that is that I met my coach. Wanda Mai met her coach on an unexpected night, but it's what he told her about competing that really took her by surprise. So I asked her if she ever competed before. She had never even heard of it. And so I kind of just gave her a quick rundown of it, invited her to a competition. Um, she said she was all in and, you know, knowing her now, I understand how I just showed her something. She was like, yep, I'm going to do it. For eight weeks, Wanda trained and dieted. And in just a year, she did something rare in earning her pro card. More um, weight involvement than just, uh, you know, hitting the gym and being laissez-faire like, casual about it. I was actually um, on a mission. Earning her pro card in a year is rare. But what's more inspiring to men and women in the industry is that she was 50 years old when she turned pro. But she was a pioneer. She was literally one of the first ones that started doing bikini at that age. I just found her to be so inspiring to me. And so now I travel um, two hours from Lake Charles area to train with her once a week. The now 52-year-old professional bikini bodybuilder's why behind her training and competing is so much more than just the bright lights and accolades. I no longer have hypothyroidism and I'm no longer insulin resistant. So that is huge. For Tiger TV, I'm Kayla Thomas.